Hey guys, it's Abby or By The Angel Books and today I am going to be sharing with you my January TBR. I have already picked out four that I for sure want to read and then the end I will be drawing one out of my TBR jar. Because this is only a TBR, I don't want it to be too too lengthy so I'll just show you the books and say a little bit about them and I'm not going to give a full synopsis so the Goodreads links for all of these will be below. First book I have on my TBR is The Opposite of Love by Julie Bexbaum. I just started this last night, so like the first chapter, first 12 pages or whatever, and I'm already loving the writing. It's kind of like this girl who's a lawyer and just like struggles with dealing with just a life events in general. It sounds really strange, but like she's very picky about how she deals with things and things need to be very ordered and she's kind of a control freak. It's just very interesting to read in her perspective and how she sees the world. So yes. The next book I have on my TBR is The Fifth Wave by Rukianti, which I'm sure most of you have already read. However, I haven't up till now when I'm deciding to read this. I have actually wanted to read it for quite a while, I just never got around to it, but I do want to see the movie when it comes out and so that just gave me like the shove to go ahead and read this this month. And I do also own The Infinite Sea, so if I really enjoy this I may also read that, so that's kind of like a bonus on my TBR, I guess. If I enjoy this, I'll read that, so. The third book on my TBR is Red Queen by Victoria Aveyard. I've actually had this book since the summer, but for whatever reason, just haven't gone around to reading it. But I do plan to this month, considering The Glass Sword is coming out next month, and I want to be a part of that. So like The Fifth Wave, that second book coming out just gave me the push to go ahead and read it, and I don't know why I haven't yet, so yes. The last book that I've actually picked out is Hit by Laurie Ann Grover, which is an extremely small book. I did start this, like, read the first three chapters or something a while back, and for whatever reason just found another book that piqued my interest, but it's, like, this girl who, like, falls in love with her college professor or something. It's weird. Basically, on the way to tell him how she feels, she gets hit by his car. And it is short, but I think I've heard really good reviews about it, and it really just displays the tragedy in a very good way. I mean, not that tragedy's good, but writes it in a very believable and, you know, eloquent way. So, very small, I think I'll be able to get through it this month, and yes, hit by Laurie Ann Grover. And now it is time to decide my last book with my great TBR jar, so we're just gonna shake it up. And uh, pick one out. I'm really excited. I really cannot grab one. So I got the Haha -ha by Dave King, which is probably good because I actually I'm interested in this book, but I don't see myself just grabbing for it, and I still do want to read it. So yes, I'm also hopefully going to read the Haha -ha by Dave King this month. Here is my completed TBR for this month. It's kind of heavy and I'm holding it with one hand, so I'm going to set it down now. Anyway, I would love for you to tell me what you plan to read in the month of January, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!